Hello everybody, this is Boz Fad and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for July 4th, 2016. Happy birthday USA! Happy birthday America! Federation of the United States have, has its birthday today and it's a very special birthday. The new moon in Cancer today is on the sun of the United States. It means that it would be a special year for the United States a new birth, in a sense, for the United States, of the role of the United States. And we can see the changes that are occurring in the States and will occur during this year with Pluto opposing the Sun of the United States in the United States second house. That means it's changes that are happening on United States ground. Hopefully positive ones and not uh, too much turmoil or uh, chaos. But it would be very interesting to see how the United States will fare in August and what would be the developments because Jupiter is on the MC of the United States at August 22nd, meaning that the United States role in front of other countries in the public arena is an important one at these times. It is a time for the United States to widen its influence, to uh, take a bigger and larger role in the international arena. At the same time, Mars and Saturn will be conjunct on the United States AC, on the horizon of the United States, amplifying that the United States would have to take action that is both mature and very much straightforward, maybe even militaristic, there would be some element of frustration there. It would be very interesting to see how these influences play out, and hopefully they will play out in a very positive manner, maybe even that, you know, it would be just that the United States would be kicking the, uh, ISIS's ass all over, hopefully, you know, but maybe it can be something more serious than that for the United States. So let's talk about July 4th. July 4th, as I said, it's a new moon in Cancer and every new moon <coughs> we always remind you that we are like sponges. Everything that we send out or take in is imprinted for the next lunar cycle, for the next couple of weeks. And today our inner hygiene, our mental, our emotional and our uh, Spiritual hygiene is very, very important. How much power and strength do we give to darkness in our life, to anxiety, to fear, to anger? How much power and strength do we give to hope, to love, to courage? Well, today, especially be mindful of these things because every little inch you give to good today would become a whole uh, yard a little later. So it will pay off. The moon is conjunct Mercury. If you are in Europe in the morning time, it's a great time for the passing off communication, the passing off messages, for writing, for speaking, uh, anything connected with the written world word is good this morning. Then there's a trine to Neptune, taking us a bit out of space and time into a more artistic and spiritual environment and a very beautiful sextile and trine by the moon to the nodes. It's a great time until around 1600 hours Central European time. That's around 900 hours Eastern Standard Time. Then we start to, uh, to feel the opposition between the moon and Pluto. We can all become very dramatic, take things out, out of proportions. We have to be careful from turmoil in our lives and our lower chakras work uh, after hours. So pardon my French, we can become a little horny. And there's a sextile to Jupiter a little later on. And if you are in the States, there's a conjunction to Venus in the nighttime. Again, um, that can contribute to uh, the same feelings that I was talking about before. So I hope you're going to have a very positive day. And thank you all for listening. This is Boaz Fader. Goodbye.